Hi right, guys, it's Tony again bringing you another description. This is another Bartrelline product. This is Bartrelline wood filler in white. Now this wood filler is for mainly for inside interior uh, because uh, obviously uh, you can't use it when it's going to be wet outside. So we'll take this door for example. You wouldn't be able to use it on anything that's like rotten down here. Or take for example along here. You know, there's just no way it's going to do. So, but for interior stuff it's fine. So what we've got here is we've got a couple of we've got some holes. Previous people have had a lock on, so I've took the uh, cap off that. First thing I want to do is I want to show you the back. All right, just let the camera focus in. All right, guys, now just pause this and see if this fits the bill. All right. Okay, so let's. You, this is a typical. Uh, this house is rented at the moment, so I'm helping a friend out. Basically, what they've done is they've put the catch on, and the original one, there's holes here, there. Really sloppy job. Uh, so, what we're going to do is we're going to put a bit of that in. All right. That's it. Takes a while to get out, actually. Put it in there. This is probably a bit overkill, to be honest. But uh, obviously, you can't put a lot of people sort of uh, they just think, "Oh, I'll put some normal filler on." And and you could do on this, but uh, when you go to paint it, you know, you're not going to be able. To, it's just not not the right stuff. I mean, you can sand this down. See, this is what people do. It's really unsightly as well. So you get those those uh, those little holes filled in. And then what's gonna happen with that, it, as soon as it dries, it can get to, it can get filled in. That's the main one. They were a couple here as well. So it's just the same step, giving this a squeeze. You have to do this quite a hard squeeze as well because it's not a it's not a filler gun. The advantages are that it doesn't dry up like filler guns. So we just get that in there. Feels good. I mean, to be honest, it feels it feels like the filler itself is reasonable quality. It dries pretty fast. It's not amazingly dry. I mean, if the filler uh, wasn't, but uh, it'll probably take a few hours for this to dry and then just get it sanded off. So yeah, it's good stuff. Bye, Bartholine. What to look out for, guys? Thanks for watching. Uh, you take care and uh, I'll be cracking on. Bye for now.